Six hours later in Vietnam. I'm so, so tempted to just answer other people's oh, questions. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, okay. That seems to have stopped. Um, a quick uh, entertainment break. I, well, I do a lot of public speaking, and this is something that I try and throw in at uh, conferences when I get a chance. I've done it a few times this year. Um, it's been trimmed down now. This latest iteration is supposed to be a seven minute lightning talk. So I did this at uh, SymphonyCon in Madrid and I did this in, at Symphony Live in Berlin and I did this at NYC Camp in New York and Drupal Sal. Uh, right, so anyway, this is about contribution. This is about all those times when, you know, you, you, you're faced with this problem with the software that you're using and, and Right? But if you're going to use it. So this is me. I don't think we've been introduced properly. Um, you'll find bits of this on the podcast, hopefully, if, we, if the editing and the recording works out. Can you see me up there? No? Okay. And uh, yeah, so I do a lot of stuff. And my other, obviously, everything is Horn Cologne there somehow. So you can also find me Horn Cologne at Gmail. That's me. I love talking with people. Right, so, so free, libre, open source software, we, we're helping make the world a better place. Um, uh, we're, we're helping NGOs, governments, universities, educators, business people, the United Nations, Drupal specifically, is in all these places, open source is in all these places. And we're working together on software that anyone can use and understand and change and share and make their own and use it to make the world a better place. So I was invited to be the keynote speaker at Drupal South in New Zealand early this year. And that was a real honor for me because, uh, um, well, I grew up in New Zealand and I hadn't been home in 20 years. So it was really powerful, really emotional uh, moment for me when I finally got there. But getting there was kind of tough. A friend of mine in Wellington offered me to rent me a room in, in, one, in a house that she owns because her tenant was away. And uh, she wrote me, this friend of mine is not very technically savvy, and she wrote me, well, there is Wi-Fi. Maybe you could make a little extra contribution if you're going to use it. <coughs> and you better check the bandwidth limit. And I was really upset. I was actually literally storming around my house yelling, you know, this is my job, damn it. I upload, you know, hours of video every month. This is what I do for a living. I was really mad and I was behaving really, really badly. And I was reacting really badly to someone who was trying to help me. So it was embarrassing. It was terrible. I, was, I, I behaved very badly. Um, so <coughs> do you ever get that feeling about Drupal? <laughs> right? Um, so right, Drupal's learning curve is so infamous that there are, that there are rage comments. Uh, comics about it, yeah? So software is frustrating. And how many of you have ever been frustrated with Drupal? <laughs> ah, and wait, and where's he though? How many is, have you ever been frustrated with Magento? <laughs> ah, so, so, right? So everybody think about something in your project that pisses you off, okay? And then something that's so bad that it makes you want to scream, and then I want you to yell it out, okay? So in Drupal, the thing that pisses me off is... Multilingual. Multilingual, <laughs> thank you. Right? Entity reference, come on, what is it? Everybody said they were pissed off by Drupal. What is it that pisses you off? Just yell it out. All the same time, go. Come on. <laughs> so when I'm speaking with PHP audiences and they sit there like this, I say, in Drupal, in Drupal rooms, this works great. Everybody screams out. <laughs> But it must be because Drupal's really not that great and your projects are so perfect that you don't say anything. So, all right, it's not very fair of you, but think of that thing that's pissing you off. So look, I was really upset, I was really frustrated, I was really angry that my friend was like, you know, oh, I'm not even gonna let you have, and maybe I'll let you have some internet, but, right? Um, and this thing really, this, this, this video from, from Louis C.K. in 2009 really kind of helped me change my perspective.
<laughs> so, so, right, the, the, theme of, the theme of this talk that Louis C.K. was doing is everything is amazing and nobody's happy, right? So the, the hashtag that I thought of first was first world problems, obviously. Like, I need to upload my stuff to the internet because it's my job. Um, and, you know, in Germany, my internet's really fast at home, so what's the problem? Um, okay, but what I was actually experiencing was privilege rage. Okay? Privilege rage. And privilege rage happens in Drupal, too, right? Um, so this is the, 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 the next slide uh, is uh, the symphony words. But privilege